This is PUBG Season 7. And being as evil as I am, I want you to watch the whole video. Because right at the end, I'm going to give you a very important tip on how to get the newest mission box for the season. Yes guys, Season 7 has got two brand new missions in Week 1 that we've never seen before. And it's a doozy. So stay tuned and see how you can get that box. Welcome to Crypt Zone. Hi guys, subscribe to my channel now so that you do not forget. Hit that bell icon and get notified of my further uploads. Lastly, feel free to comment. Show me some love by giving me a thumbs up at the end of the video. You can also support me by following this link. Welcome back to the channel guys and this is PUBG Mobile and also Season 7. Before we carry on, let's see what's new, what's changed, what's added. The update was yesterday and uh, RP was still locked in. So first of all, let's check my clan. So let's see what my rank is for the previous season. My clan was in the top 69.6% of which there was 41,946 activity points done and this was only for a clan that existed for a bit more than two weeks. So to my clan members, thank you very much for participating and getting our clan up in the high scores. This season, we will definitely improve on that. So let's quickly see, today's clan mission is... Total rounds fired in any mode, 200 rounds. So that will be our mission to beat for today. And here we are. Season 7. Let's just quickly collect that. And as you guys know, with Season 7 and the new season coming in, all the tiers has been reset to a level lower than where you were. So my platinum is all down to gold. Gold is down to silver, silver down to bronze, and so on and so forth. I'm sure you guys noticed with the new events that you have to collect sandwiches this time. And I am definitely gunning for this one. We have 40 sandwiches for 50 RP. I think most of the guys will try and go for that one. So let's go ahead and upgrade my Royal Pass. I got enough UC uh, from the last season. So I can actually just... Um, buy some for free there we go upgrade it to the new season 7 royal pass so let's quickly see what's new in the royal pass so you're going to choose one of the two outfits you want to wear at the end of uh, level 100 because you'll get one of them, so you can choose. You're going to get enough UC again to buy your next level or your next season for free again. Now you've got smoke trails on your feet as you go down with your parachute. You're going to have a nice colorful smoke trail. And you also have new helmets, new backpacks, new weapon skins, and so on. And you'll also notice most of these helmets and stuff actually... Um, has an Air Force theme to it. I think it's to com to to combine in with the new game for peace that we're gonna get. That's gonna replace PUBG Mobile, so that you're already into the new theme. Mm -hmm. well, level one got some uh, the new helmet, got the new clothing there, new sections, and then uh, really collected some new C. I've already spent the first 500 RP for last season. So let's just quickly collect all our new stuff. And let's quickly, if I have time, let's see what else we can see. What's, what can we find? Sorry for any external noises, guys. Uh, unfortunately, when I do recording, some recordings, there's no helping it. So let's see, you're going to get some smoke trails, money, there's new bike skins over there, RP cards, a new dance. 
Oh my word, this is so freaking gay. This is definitely not for the dudes. Some other trails. There's a nice backpack. I actually like that backpack a lot. That's what it looks like. Okay, you see again. Gun skin again. You can get some couple of gun skins there. Airplane skin. There's your avatar. A real pass avatar for season 7. New parachute. Or new parachute skin. So as I told you, Air Force theme. That's part of that. Air Force helmet. Yeah, it won't change now because I've got the helmet on. Also, guys use this at the Air Force, it's what part of their kits. Another avatar, military operation avatar. And only at level 70 will you get the beard. Which I'm actually looking forward to, I actually want to get my guy a beard. And yes, if you've noticed, I've swapped my avatar this season from female to male, so I'm back to being a dude. And for the rest of the season, it's money, coins, same old, same old, same old. Some new stuff that's been added are these ticket uh, mission licenses. So you get so a couple of perks if you can do what they say in the perk. I'm still not actually 100% sure how it's going to work at the end of the day, but you get a couple of perks. Up next is the new ranking system for season 7. So let's take a look at the new world pass. So today's mission is to kill two people with the M416. Let's check what the rest of the week has. So as you can see we're back to 8 weeks again for this season. We're starting at week 1. Uh, finish in the top 3. What's it? Twice. Yeah, with the friends. Okay. Then that's a new one. Killing two enemies within the first 300 seconds from landing in classic mode. That's a new one. Give 20 likes to your friend. Do the clap or greet emoji in Pucheki. That we can do. This one is new. Land at least 1500 meters away from your parachute location. I'll tell you now how that one works because I wasn't sure. Kill people with the M416 20. And... Uh, Complete 10 matches in arcade mode. That's easy. Revive a teammate 5 times. Okay, so basic standard stuff with two brand new type of missions that we haven't seen before in previous seasons. <coughs> okay, now since we have a brand new Middle East server, let's try and see what it's like. Of course, it's the first mm -hmm. time that I'm going to play on this server. So everything is down to bronze. So don't expect any resistance whatsoever. A lot of bots. This will probably be an extremely easy game. But I want to see how quickly the Middle East server goes into the game compared to the Europe server, which I normally use. And I also want to see what is the ping like and how stable is it. Okay. Here we go. Let's see how quickly this goes in. Instantaneously. Okay guys, let's see if I can open up some of those um, boxes today. Now, please watch until the end of the video. I'm going to give you the big clue on how to open up the 1500 meter distance away that you have to land from the parachute location. The description is actually wrong. It's actually a stupid description. Because for me, it says that I have to put a pin location and land 1,500 meters away from that location. Which is not how it was, it's not how it worked. And I did get that box. So, let's see what we're going to do. We're going to probably land in Pucheki, or Pucheki, which is my normal spot. And then we'll start off with the uh, emoji.
Okay, let's first start off by giving a wave. That opens up our first box for the first uh, for season seven. Now let's get some some weapons. I had such an awesome game yesterday. Unfortunately, I recorded on the wrong capture device, which forced me not to record any video, only sound. But I played yesterday in Puchiki, uh, in in Vikendi, sorry, and I got ten kills, a chicken dinner, and all, while only shooting with the new scorpion. I actually really enjoyed using that scorpion. Yeah, unfortunately I couldn't show you guys that. So, I actually want the M416. That's what I actually want, since I have to kill two people with that. To get my second box for today. And also to complete my daily mission. Customer inbound. Ah, he's coming up to visit me. Seems like the AI on the bots have changed, so now the bots run away. Unfortunately not far enough, buddy. Ah, awesome. Just what we need. Now we can see how far we can push this, this one. Can we finish our daily mission with the two kills and also start ranking up some kills for the... Uh, a uh, weekly mission that said you must kill at least 20 people with an M416. So I'm still looking for a decent scope. Got some action going on. I don't really see those guys. I'm definitely shooting there somewhere in the field. Customer inbound. Goodbye. See. Trying to see where those guys were shooting from, if I can see any movement. Yeah, there we go. That's number three. Ooh, AR suppressor. Awesome. I like that.
Right, another customer inbound. And he's running away. Right, let's go find him. Let's go say hi. Where are you? Where are you? There you are. Take that. Oh, there's your friend as well. Also another bot. So far I think I'm just getting bots. I'm not getting any people so far. Um, just goes to show what I told you. It's a new server. My level is down to bronze 5. So I the only resistance I have is bots. So actually no resistance. At this point, I'm just looking for better scopes and see where I can find some more people to shoot. So, nothing really interesting happening at the moment. It's quiet and cheeky. So, I'm just running around seeing what I can pick up. And I think the circle is going to move towards the ruin section. So... I just want to keep an eye on that circle and see where it's going to go to. Another customer coming. Oh yeah, shoot the wall. Yeah. Another one coming. Yeah, now we're picking up some customers. Ah, oh, he's coming in. Really? Really? Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. I think he's outside. Yeah. Have you guys seen a bot loot another bot before? Or was that a real person? Drop a comment in the comments and uh, let's see what you guys think. Was that a bot? Or was it a real person?
Okay, as predicted, we're going to the ruins. Let's see what we can find there. I can't remember if those sandbags were there before. Uh, first time I see them. But I could be wrong. Ah, someone coming. Thank you. Another one. Uh, oh, he's going inside. I don't want to take a chance and go through the window. Ah. That was a definitely another bot. Unless we have some real, real noobs on this uh, new server. Uh, I guess that was bot. Ah, four times cup. At last, something a bit more decent. Hey, hey, hey. Go pick up your four times. Yo. Thank you. I just want those Godzilla blue t-shirts. I actually picked up a couple of them yesterday. So let's just put one on for now. Um, actually, I'm left in the dark about this. I'm not sure what the Godzilla t-shirts are all about. But yeah, it's not giving you any special abilities or anything. I think it maybe it's part of a movie or something. I don't know. I'm a bit out of the loop on that one. Customer incoming. Where are you? Where are you? There you are. And that was definitely a bot. I see you. Let's get a bit closer. Bit of a clear shot. There we go.
Okay, so we're close to the circle. And it's here by the ruins. And uh, yeah, let's just get off this hill toppy or mountain toppy, whatever you want to call it, because you see your silhouette in the background, it's easier to shoot you. <laughs> Stay in the ravine, boys. Let's see if there's anybody following me. Nobody coming from the back. Hey, 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 there's someone. Uh, better put it on single. Automatic on long distance really does not do the trick. I think this is a dude. I don't think that's a bot. Unless they decide to run to the closest cover. Nah, uh, this one is, I think, a real player. He doesn't know where the shots are coming from. And that's all she wrote. Anyone else? Nope. Okay. Let's go. Okay, I think I've looked around enough. It looks very clear. There's nobody coming from the blue. If there was anyone coming this way, I would have seen them by now. It's actually quite easy to spot anyone coming, but yeah, it's clear. Okay, there's a guy going for the airdrop, I think. But he's way too far for me to do any damage. Maybe if I had a better scope, I could have maybe taken him in out, but I don't think so. There's a car now. I think the guy's gonna go for that airdrop, but as you can see, I cannot even see him, I can only see the car. So there's no point in trying to shoot him. Anyway, let's continue. He drove off, so he drove into that direction. He took his stuff and he left with his little car. Um, yeah, let's try and get onto that side because uh, I don't really like being in the water. You're too vulnerable. Anyone can shoot you. There's nothing you can do to fight back. So. I'm not really uh, fond of swimming in the water anyway. Okay guys, here we go. This is the last few minutes of this match. I've got 12 kills. There's 3 alive. Circle is almost done. The blue is going to move in any second now. And there's 3 people over. So let's see how it played out. So if I'm not seeing anyone specifically, putting the gun on full O2 because we're not going to shoot someone very far and uh, shooting one shot at a time gets you killed. Ah, there we go, there we go. Someone's shooting in that direction. There's two left, that means the guy is definitely in that direction. Now I don't want to be too exposed or too visible, so I'm going prone. Seeing if I can see that guy.
Let me crawl a bit forward, get a bit closer. Looking for movement, looking for anything. There's a blue. Ah, there's someone. I saw him, I saw him, I saw him. Come on. <clears throat> I saw you moving. Where are you? I saw your head. I saw that. Ah, there we go, there we go, there we go. Do you just aim, aim, aim. Come on, come on. He sees me. And that's it, boys and girls. Chicken dinner. Awesome. Let's look at the stats quickly. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. My first win on the first week of the new season. Triple S rating. Awesome. Over a thousand damage. And look at all those medals. But obviously, as I said, it's bronze, it's bots. The challenge. Okay, so tip of the week. Land a thousand meters more or less away from your uh, parachute point or whatever they should have said land a thousand five hundred meters away from your flight path that would have made more sense don't you think so I was putting the marker down somewhere and trying to land a thousand five hundred meters away from the marker because that's my parachute point where I was gonna land clearly that's not how it works if you land a thousand six hundred meters away, you don't get it. If you land a thousand four hundred meters away, you get it. If you travel towards the mark. So the easiest way to get this uh, box, take your flight path, put your pin location down a thousand five hundred meters away from that point, and just go land on your point, and it's done. Don't believe me? view the results yourself so thanks guys thanks for watching give me a thumbs up if you liked the video and i'll see you guys next time cheers